Felix Mendelssohn Bartholdi has been my desert island composer for many years. And so when we met somewhere in the Dutch countryside in a beautiful studio, there was a palpable excitement. This would be a really meaningful moment for us to record this music. And dare I say, I think it turned out to be one of the most spectacular collaborations that I've done so far for Petaton. Alistair Beetson played on an Erar from 1837 and this changed everything because the piano that he used in a way was like almost like an instruction manual for me to understand the music that we were recording um, just by the sound world that Alistair together with his piano brought um, to this recording. While I had been playing the repertoire by Felix Mendelssohn uh, for cello and piano for many years, um, the music that his sister Fanny um, Hensel wrote was actually new to me. And I must say, this was really such a beautiful discovery to find these gems by this uh, wonderful composer. A big part of Fanny Hensel's biography, of course, is that um, as a woman uh, she did not have the same possibilities to compose and to express herself like her brother Felix. Um, but in the end, that is not the defining factor for me, or I'm not even that interested in that narrative, just because her music is so excellent and it speaks such of such a personal language that I'm much more interested and fascinated um, by her composition. The story of these compositions for piano and cello by Fanny and Felix Mendelssohn is not only a story between the two siblings um, who were all their life in very close correspondence and friendship and love, but we have to include a third member in this family affair, which is Paul Mendelssohn, um, who was a banker by, uh, by definition, but he was an excellent amateur cellist. And he must have been excellent um, because actually these pieces are quite uh, challenging for the cello, not to speak um, of the really very demanding piano parts. Um, but I love the idea that the two siblings were writing for Paul um, with him in mind. And I'm sure there must have been also some family quarrel at times and maybe they were trying to, uh, you know, throw him a little curveball with these rather demanding compositions. Mm -hmm. 
I think this music could not be more personal and so I'm very happy um, that we were able to combine the music of Felix and Fanny on one recording for Pentaton. Thank you.